Hello and welcome to tutorial number 25. Uh, I was taking some screenshots yesterday for BAT and our new JET listing for Community Builder 2.0 and BAT had this comment on the user list we're seeing right here. I mean, it's basically four columns where I've spaced the columns out evenly and he said correctly <laughs> that, you know, uh, column one, for example, and column three don't need that much space. And you see column two can use more space so it doesn't have to wrap around uh, the member since about, you know, and all this stuff here. And of course he was right. So let's just take a look at our user list in the back end and see what's responsible for the spacing. If you look at the columns, we see we have one, two, three, four columns. And if you remember the tutorial when we were uh, playing and co constructing this list, uh, we basically said that this size dropdown is from one to 12. And Bootstrap basically has its grid uh, separated into 12 units. So the maximum is 12. If you want to have four columns evenly spaced, we have to put each uh, size at three. And that's what we did. But let's say we want to give less space to the first column and more space to the second. So let's just go here and change this to two and change the second one to four and save that. I mean, if the, the sum will still be 12, 2 and 4 is 6, 3 and 3 is 6, 6 and 6 is 12. But if we go to the front end now and refresh this, we'll see there's less space here now. And now it doesn't wrap. This, this wraps here. What we can do is probably make uh, 2, the, the third column, a little narrower and give that extra space to the second column. So let's go back and give the third column, make that two, and make the second column five now. Again, the sum will be 12. And let's look at what that looks like in the front end now. Much better. This didn't wrap, no, this, this, this is good now. So I think that's, I mean, uh, we could probably do something similar here, because uh, this is kind of narrow here. Let's try, let's just experiment here. Let's make this one. Well, actually, let's make the avatar one and give additional info for save. and refresh. See what happened now? The avatar, because the space is not enough, we get a much smaller avatar here. So let's go back and change that. That wasn't the right thing to do. Put this back to two and keep this at three. Anyway, you get the idea now. I mean, how can you, you can experiment and play with the sizing depending on how many columns you have. But this looks much better than it did before. Okay, that's it for now. I just wanted to quickly pass this information on because you might not uh, be aware of how to make this work for you. Thanks for listening. Hope to see you again next tutorial. Bye-bye.